Hey YouTubians, welcome back to my space room. It's been quite some time. Well, today I have a video that I think a lot of you women will be interested in. It's on these um, lipsticks that I got from MAC. Two of them are fake and this one is round. So basically, I'm just going to show you how you can spot fake um, MAC lipsticks in case you're wrongdoing or in case someone is trying to sell you some on the street. I actually got these when I was in New York and my best friend was like, don't get them. I'm like, why not? They're MAC. And you know what? This is really Osmo's heads on. This is like really most legit if they would have put a little more effort into it they could get a lot of people seriously because they got me the guy so i was a dread anyways so we're gonna go into the details i'm gonna sit this one here because i can't carry all three at the same time well i can but two is better than three it actually is not anyways so i have pink pigeon Pink Pigeon is real and Cyber is fake, okay? So, how you can tell is the texture. When you can just slide your fingers up and down. The real one feel really smooth and your hands should just glide across it. This one is like kind of hard and it like stops and then it like picks up. If you know what I mean, like you know how when you like um rubbing somebody's hair and it's like brittle and then you like rubbing it and then it stops because it's too hard and then it keeps going this one it doesn't do that it's just like like so soft okay the second thing is the sparkles the sparkles are silver you see and this one you can barely see the sparkles on the fake one okay um, the another thing is the rim. If you can see, this rim is really silver and it's like a square type. This one is rounded and this silver is more finer than this one. This one looks dull. Dull. And then the MAC symbol, the MAC sign is still there. This one, it doesn't have the MAC sign. Because it faded. And I'm not going to lie. Some MAC glosses. Some MAC lipsticks fades. But this one faded like in within two weeks. And I got these and I was, um faded. The other fake one faded too. If you can see. Okay. Like you can see a little bit of it. Like a little hint of it. But the word, the lettering. I wish I had the lettering so I can show you. But the lettering didn't even match up with it, okay? And then this one is like an oval shape. And this one is like pointy. And the bottom, they look pretty. The bottom is focusing now. On the fake one, the writing going around it is really thin. On the real one, it's thick. On the, like, the name of the color, it is thick. And the number as well is thick how it's supposed to be it tells you that it's matte or satan what kind of texture lipstick is it and yeah and it says that it's made in toronto canada which i don't believe so second we're gonna take the tops off i'm just gonna keep the i'm just gonna keep it like this so you guys know that this is the real one this is the fake one okay so we're gonna pop the tops Oh, and another thing I learned, so this is the fake MAC top, right? And it goes on perfect. This one is like a struggle for the real one. So the letter in, this is the real one, this is the fake one, remember? The letter in on the real one, hold on, it needs to focus. Okay, I know my, Mac, my lipsticks are really, really messy, okay, whatever. So this is the real one, this is the fake one. The real one, the silver is like a platinum silver. The fake one, it is like, 
It just looks cheap. Like, you know it's not real, right? And then even the thingies going around it. They are big and flat. These are small and pointy, if you see what I mean. And like I told you, the rim going around this one, it is square. And the rim around this one, it is like a circle and very thin. So, yeah. That's basically how you can tell fake lipstick from a real lipstick. And I am going to do lip swatches on the fake ones because I really get, especially on Cyber, I get a lot of compliments, you guys on cyber and it kind of looks like the real lipstick i was a little shaky oh yeah but inside i'm going to show you guys inside so let me swap it inside even looks different like that's how real it is i'm gonna try on the real one because i don't think it's that serious but i just want to show you dolls how much of the fake ones look like real ones that's why he got me i want to let me see him in brooklyn again but it's kind of crazy because like i told my best friend because she was so pissed off because she actually gave me the money because i didn't have no cash i just had my cards on me i don't like to carry cash and she kept like why you want to get them you just want to love waste that money girl and all of this like girl shut up shut up telling you <laughs> so this one here is diva and I'm going to swatch it for you too you see on a cyber Like, they really almost look like... This is Cyber. This one is my uh, favorite out of both. <laughs> okay, guys. So, this is Cyber. This is Diva. And this is Pink Pit. So you see how Diva is all spread out? Cyber does the same thing. But Pink Pigeon does not. Like, it does not move. That's another detail how I found out that these lipsticks were. But it's all good because every beauty guru needs fake makeup in their makeup collection, okay? My YouTubians for watching this video with me. If you enjoyed this video, please like subscribe if you're not a subscriber already um leave a comment i love reading comments and yeah <laughs> so you should subscribe to stay in contact you can follow me on snapchat at miss adorable with a z um you can follow my facebook page fashion forever follow me on instagram at at Hola Base Goddess, and yeah, you're now leaving the space room. Bye. Mwah.